welcome to my beauty box. It's been a while, right? Um, I actually have been really busy for the last several weeks or so, but I'm finally having a breather. And I'm so excited to be back today with new content for you guys. Um, I'm actually going to be heading out to Soho in a little bit to meet up with a few friends for brunch. But since it's been a while since I meet up, since I get a chance to meet up with, with these girls, um, I decided to dress up a little bit today. But I also want to take this opportunity to show you guys the process of creating my today's look. It will be something really simple that anyone, including those that are new to makeup, can create within 15-20 minutes maximum. So please stay tuned and let's get started. I'm gonna start with a primer uh, and this is the Clay de Paul Correcting Cream Dough. I actually have only started using this recently but I love how it helps correct my skin tone, cover up my pores, as well as helping my makeup stay even in this insane 8 degree weather in New York City. The only downside is this product is pretty pricey um, for such a small tube product. I'm gonna be applying this from and zero cushions on my tie base. I prefer cushion over traditional foundation because it's very easy to use. It's also convenient for reapplication when I need to touch up my makeup throughout the day. With this ramen uh, zero cushion, unless you have a lot of imperfections, you would only need to apply a thin layer because it does provide a pretty good coverage. Um, it is also semi-matte finish, so I highly recommend it for oily and combination skin. Next, I'm going to be using this concealer on a brush to cover up my dark circles, uh, any blemishes, and dark spots. The concealer that I'm using for this look is actually also from Clay de Paul, and it is actually one of the brand's best sellers. I like to use it for under eyes and like for minor imperfections, but um, it may not be your best choice if you have active inflamed acne that may need a lot of coverage. So I'm gonna create my entire simple eye makeup from this S4 Real Eye Palette and this is the number one peach tea like. First, I will apply the base shadow using the number four. Then number two on my upper lids and lower lids. Then number six starting from the outer edge of my upper and lower lids. Now using this Clio eyeliner liquid pencil, I will draw a very thin line right at and under my lash line. I actually prefer a thin line over a bold line because I think a thin line will give my eyes a more natural look. Finally, with an eyeliner brush, I'm gonna use number 7 from the same palette and go over my eyeliner to kind of soften the line.
Now onto the lips. I'm gonna use this Hera Sensual Lip Gloss. This is in shade 422. Uh, Sensual Spicy Nude Gloss is the exact name. It's for the makeup. How do you guys like it? Oh, hang in there. I'm actually gonna go change into my Judy's outfit and style my hair to complete the look. So stay tuned.